Uh, well, you know, like for legal purposes, it's a story. <laughs> and it combines Einstein's theory of relativity with getting absolutely off your face on a Friday tea time. <laughs> it's 5.37. There's five blokes in a kitchen, two of which are smoking weed, while the other three do two drops each of LSD as well. The smoking two refrain for reasons they define, and that's fine. There's no peer pressure, no pressure at all. Every negative has been shown the door and asked to leave. The only requirement is simply to be. Find your level and then give it. Let the equation unfold before your eyes. Breathe deep. Do the basics, count to ten and wait. For the kick in, the kick on, the kick back, sit back, relax and get some tunes on. Turn the lights on, turn every switch on. Because we want to witness this in bright light. High definition, fully pixelated life. Get the kettle on and the beers out. Three sheet Rizzle origami projects, equations in themselves. Cups of tea, beer. Suddenly, it's all on the go. It's all happening here. This simple kitchen has just become the most vibrant place on planet fucking earth. Add to that the fact that it's a Friday evening. By default, subtracting the need to go to work tomorrow. The equation seems to be working itself out quite nicely. These five boys are now prime, beginning to feel at one with the situation and divisible only by their own undoing. And that's not going to happen. Not now, not tonight. It's Friday and this kitchen is fucking amazing. Everybody's visiting the favourite parts of their own head, finding valuable treasures and then coming back to the table with tales to tell like... When you were in Gower and your mate nearly died, or nights out in Newcastle, or mushroom picking, trolley pushing, making love in the middle of a shift, or together with your mates in a garage at 14 and off your fucking tits, when the time 20 past 11 became a mantra for the good times, which when repeated and repeated and given out freely became recurring equations that happened. Every time you opened your arms out wide to Einstein and let the theory of relativity in, tonight, these five boys are multiplying good times upon the table, taking every memory and treating it with grace, respect and the odd piss take. Because mates, your real mates, they always give you hope back in the same shape it was given, only bigger. Because that's what we do given the time and the tools, we, give, we turn our own equations into something. Something quite special. Real time moves forward to 7.43 and our five prime and our flying feeling really free. One of the two drops takes the music on and just goes. He's there. He's on it. Lost in trance, he starts to dance then begins to believe that he's in it. That he's one of the beats that's bouncing around in the 140 there are in a minute. And the three sheet Rizzle boys, they're feeling like talking about this, about trying to work this out. This equation, this high of life. They feel like talking about the infinity of it all. He's dancing while one of the others is just staring at a wall. But his smile says it all. He's okay, he's at play, he's got nothing to say. He's cool, that's cool. There is a severe lack of rules here. There are no boundaries here. There are no battle lines drawn or undrawn. There's just a growing sense that this equation is going to last until dawn. And the three sheet whistle boys. They feel like talking about this, about trying to work this out. Why can't more weekends start with Friday nights like this? Because this kitchen, this kitchen is truly amazing. And the last of the two drops, well, he's just laughing like there's no tomorrow because in his head, currently, there isn't. He's lost in laughter in this simple room, off gone giggling in the garden of the mushroom. And the three sheep whistle boys, well, they just want to work this out. Why equations were meant for occasions like this, why occasions were meant for equations like this, but it's all working itself out quite nicely. And the kitchen is at peace with those within because they all opened their arms out wide to Einstein and let the equation in. Thank you for listening. Cheers.